Hi everybody, it's Ginger with Marvelous Mouse Travels. This is my kiddo and we are packing for a Disney cruise. We're leaving tomorrow for our first ever cruise on the Disney Wish and we're going to show you a little bit about how we pack for a Disney cruise. So we're going to start with our carry-on bag first. So your carry-on bag should really have the necessities, things that you need to have with you. So obviously your citizenship documents, um, but also things like your medications. So here, this is just a backpack style bag. I have our port arrival form printed off in here. Um, I also, that has our reservation number on it. This has all of our passports inside here we're also going to have our IDs and this is a really great little carrying case because this is RFID blocking and you can just slip it right over your wrist so this has all four of our passports right here plus you know we can put credit cards we could put our driver's license in there if we wanted to so it's really handy to have that and then I also have all of our medications in here. So I have our prescription medications. It's really important too with Disney Cruise Line, you have to keep your prescription medications in their original um, bottles. So you can't put them in like a, a pill organizing device or anything like that. They have to stay in their original packaging. But we have our C-bands in here. We have some Dramamine just in case. So all of our medications and everything are here in this bag. Also in my carry-on, of course, I've got some of, of my other essentials, like my sunglasses, and I have my uh, wonderful lip balm for if my lips get dried out in the balmy sea air. So that's what is in our carry-on bag. Now I'm going to move over to our main suitcase here. And you'll see in our suitcase, now on a Disney cruise, each person can bring up to two bags on board, but staterooms are small. So we're going to try not to bring quite that many bags. But one of my favorite space saving tips are these packing cubes. These are amazing. Um, they come in sets of several different allotments. I just bought these off of Amazon. We can put some links in the description if you're interested in things like that. But these make it so easy to keep not only your clothing organized, but you can get so much more space in your suitcase by using these packing cubes. So I still have tons of room in uh, this and even, and this is pretty much all of our clothes that we're taking for the cruise. So I really love these packing cubes. They're awesome. I also have underneath here a collapsible laundry hamper. And I bring this with us on every trip, not just on cruises, but I cannot stand dirty clothes to be on the floor in my hotel room or my stateroom. And so this just, you can untie right here and it pops up to a pretty good size laundry hamper. And it also has a carrying strap. So if you wanna do laundry on the cruise, you can just carry this right over there. Super easy uh, to pop it in the machine. Um, speaking of which, I'll show you some other handy things that I have for stateroom organization here in this cube. So we have, um, I am partial to a particular brand of laundry detergent. This comes from Buff City Soap. So I bring this with me when we travel. This is just like a little travel size that you can grab. I have a little um, thing that has my jewelry in it. I have, of course, some sunscreens here. But we also have, now this is not super glamorous, but it's really important for small spaces. Um, this is poopery. This is something that you spray into the potty before you go number two, and it contains the smell. So in a small stateroom, this is a lifesaver. We have that with us. We also have some nice little magnetic hooks. So these just stick right to the stateroom door or the stateroom walls and you can hang your lanyards on it or other things like that. Um, you don't wanna hang anything super heavy on these, but they are nice to just hang up, you know, your lanyards and little things like that so that they're within easy access. And then of course we have a cute little magnet for our stateroom door. Um, and so we, we want to decorate our stateroom door. That's a really common thing that people do on Disney cruises. And so we're really excited 
uh, to do that to our door. So we are on a Bahamian cruise, which means that we are gonna get to make a stop at Disney's Castaway Key, which is their private island. So we've gotta have our beach day essentials. I love this particular beach bag because it has holes in it. And if you get sand or anything like that in this bag, you can literally just spray it out uh, with water. So it's super easy to clean, but it also is really roomy. It's, it's really easy to carry all the stuff you want to the beach. We have some beach toys in here. I'm not gonna pull all of these out, but we also brought our own refillable tumblers because you know sodas and juices and everything are included with your cruise fare um, but they only give you like the little kind of quick service disposable cups which you know don't have a lot at all and so we like these because you can you can fill it up and take it with you to the pool or something like that i also have a similar turvis you know cup like that um, for uh, for coffee because i am a big coffee drinker but one of my favorite things in the beach bag are these towel clips uh, because it does get really windy on cruise ships and so these towel clips are great because they just clip your towel right to your beach chair so it doesn't blow off while you're sitting at the pool or on the beach or something like that. So that is our beach bag. So I hope that you've enjoyed learning a little bit about how we pack for a Disney cruise and what we bring along with us. Be sure to check back, subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed already, hit your bell notifications because we're gonna be releasing a lot of Disney Cruise Line content. We're gonna have a stateroom tour. We're gonna be showing you around the wish. We're gonna be showing you some of the onboard activities and some of the ports of call. So we're really excited about this cruise, but we're also really excited to share it with you. And keep in mind that it is the same price to book your Disney cruise or any destination directly through me that it would be if you just booked that online yourself um, because you are not paying an extra penny for my services when you book with me though you are getting free concierge level vacation planning services so go to gingermmt.com to request a free quote on your vacation and also to learn a little bit more about my services again I'm Ginger with Marvelous Mouse Travels thank you so much for watching